Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for Wednesday, May 30th. We're going to use all these decks today. This is daily vibes for Wednesday, May 30th. Keep in mind that the energies are fluid. That means the timing is fluid. This could have happened, maybe happening now or in the future. This is for all signs. Daily energy for Wednesday. For Wednesday, May 30th. Ooh. Reality check. Reality check. Something is disappointing. Somebody's thinking about leaving, accepting the reality. Full moon, moon, moon. Huh, interesting, huh? So this full moon is... You know, full moons usually bring uh, confusion, but this full moon might bring you some clarity, okay? It might, about a situation that, you know, in regards to love, if you, if you think about this, this is a one cup, that would be the ace of cups, right? About love. Somebody is thinking about a situation in their love life, thinking about leaving it, or they're thinking about reconciling. That could certainly be the case. Thinking about going back. Interesting. Hmm. Somebody is seeing the truth. Ah. Somebody's thinking about leaving a situation and taking care of business on their own. I don't, yeah, I mean, that's what this is. Somebody is thinking about becoming independent. Moving on, moving, moving on, moving, transitioning out of this situation. If somebody is going through some sort of transition and they're thinking about moving on or they have moved on. They're feeling really good about what they've done. They made the right decision. Somebody has moved on or they are thinking about moving on. Because they see their worth. They see what they're worth. Interesting. Yeah. Somebody has is coming out of darkness. Five of Cups reversed. It's like I realize the truth. That's true. Somebody is seeing the truth of a situation. Somebody has already made the decision to leave and they've left and they've transitioned and they've moved on. And they're proud of it or they're about to. Yeah. Somebody is feeling really good about independence right now. Yeah. They're feeling really good about being by themselves. Interesting. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> Ooh. Ah. Sorry. Um. Let me get this zoomed in. There's an opportunity for love here. Okay, there is. Obviously, we can tell with that lover's card. There's an opportunity for a union, a contract, you know, uh, coming together. Um, but there's some opposition here. Thing is, you might have to leave a situation fully so that you can have this new contract. This is do I stay or do I go? And this is kind of like the same thing. So somebody, somebody is still holding on, but somebody has freed themselves. Interesting, interesting. The per people that have freed themselves and moved on could have a new opportunity because this could be a new opportunity in love. For those of you that have freed yourself and you're feeling really good about where you're at, there's probably a new opportunity. Somebody that's better suited for you. This could come in very, very suddenly. Okay, it could be. It could come in very suddenly. And, you know, this could even come in if you're coupled. I, I mean, I have to tell you, there could be a sudden attraction that pops up that is undeniable. Okay, but you're still holding on to something that doesn't serve you. So that's really interesting. I feel like somebody has to definitely free themselves from a toxic situation. Some of you have, some of you still need to do it. It's going to take strength and confidence and courage to free yourself. 
okay? But once you do, there's a new opportunity for love, somebody that's better suited for you. So for some of you today, you will meet this person today. Some of you will not. Somebody, some, some of you, it's in the future or it's already happened, but there is a new opportunity for love. Okay, there is, but somebody that is going to love you for who you are. They're going to love you for, for exactly who you are. They're not in it just for superficial things. I feel like this person is the truth okay it's the it's the real deal so i feel like there's an opportunity for love here that is is the real deal there's could even be a reconciliation just saying um i feel like there was a a break okay for some of you there was a break that leads you could be leads you back to this person so i don't know what this is but for some of you, you actually never really did let go. Some of you have held on. You were independent for a while, and now this person is finally coming back. So, you know, this is going to resonate with whoever. For some of you, there's a new opportunity. Um, but I do feel like somebody has restored control in their life, and now there is definitely a new opportunity for love. So this is definitely a love reading. I feel like... Whoever this person is, they're going to make you feel weak. They're going to make, they make you feel weak. They make you crumble. Whoever this person is that comes into your life is going to make you feel like weak in the knees. This is like a soulmate connection. Okay. There could be a reconciliation with a soulmate. Just saying. And this doesn't have to be today. It could be, you know, could have already happened in the recent past or in the near future. But I think that somebody may have thought the grass was greener on the other side they got single you know and they thought it was going to be great and they enjoyed it but they still want to go back whatever this is i don't know but i'm just saying somebody just wants to be single as well it's to restore control so i feel like but i do feel like there's an opportunity for love here there's an opportunity for love. And I, th for some of you, it's a reconciliation. There's a lot of seduction. There is a soulmate connection that's undeniable. And I feel like somebody has been at a complete loss waiting for this to happen. Son of a gun. They could never really let go because they knew it was a soulmate connection. Interesting. But they did take the time to restore balance in their life while there was this separation. I feel like there was a separation where somebody kind of embraced the separation to learn and heal and grow. Interesting. So we're going to get one of these. This is for Wednesday the 23rd. The truth is about to come out. Okay. That's what's happening. The truth in regards to a relationship is coming out. It's on the table. The grass wasn't greener on the other side. And somebody is being called to give the relationship a chance. Work on the partnership. Maybe that's what they decide to do. <clears throat> One more. Worth wait. See, this is for two groups of people. It is. Some of you are being called to give the relationship. Whoever's coming to your mind right now that has walked away or whatever. There's an opportunity for reconciliation. I see it. It's. I feel it. This one, worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work at work in your love life. Again, stay, same for this situation. The time is now to reconcile for some of you. Okay, it is. For some of you, you've been waiting patiently, working on yourself, becoming abundant, and you know, just taking care of business and your own independence. And now's the time. Divine timing is playing out. And I feel like there is an opportunity for love here. Okay? There is. Somebody has restored control in their life. They've learned some lessons and now there's a there's a coming together. It's what you've been waiting for. And I think I said worth that you've been waiting for this for a while before this came out. I feel like somebody is coming out of a period of darkness and waiting. I think the waiting is just about over. Inspire passion. 
Life devoid of passion can be boring, uninspired, blank canvas that slowly drains the soul. Now is time to reignite your passions and rejoin life. This is an opportunity to set new goals, which will, turn, which will in turn reconnect you with all that is sacred. Somebody has. Somebody has set new goals, and now they know what they want. And the time is now for this union to come together. There is a union here after a period of independence. For some of you, you're just going into this independence. It's just starting, and it will take time to get here. But I feel like this is a sudden connection or reconciliation that happens out of the blue, and it's undeniable, and I think there's a soulmate connection. So, and this is what I have for Wednesday the 23rd. Thank you for watching.